I got a big box on the doorstep tonight. You guys wanna see what I got? Let's check it out. Paula Young, of course. We got Alma and Brandy and Easton. Hudson, Kira, Erica, one more, it looks like a Jacqueline Smith, spotlight. So I'm going to go ahead and try all of these wigs on. If you want to join me, maybe you want to grab a cup of coffee, a cup of tea. If it's evening, grab yourself a glass of wine and let's go. and I am so happy that you're here with me. I have got a hair mail delivery and I thought it would be super fun to unbox and try them on on camera. Now I will go ahead and do full reviews on these wigs, but I just wanna show you how they look right out of the box. And I also wanna let you know that I am wearing the beautiful new Andy and she is in that new exclusive color almond butter. I did a review of Andy, so I'm gonna link that over here. You can also expand that description box and that will also have a link in there to go watch the review of Andy. This new color almond butter is just beautiful. A number of you have asked me if it's a gray. No, absolutely not. It is just a beautiful ash blonde, but it has this number 10 ash brown root, which I just think is beautiful. I love the colors in this one. Now I styled it a little bit differently than I showed you in the review video. I just use a little bit of John Renault Peace Out Cream just to get a little bit of volume up on top. So it's so much fun. So I also wanna remind you if you are interested in shopping at Polly Young and purchasing any of these wigs that you see here today, you can use my discount code BBH20. Now that's gonna save you 20% off of each wig that's $49.99 and over, excluding clearance. And guess what? You can use it every single time you shop. Let's start with the new style Erica. I bought her in the color SF1026, that's buttered toast. She is a long shag. I did see Erica when I was at the photo shoot in July and she looked super pretty on the model. So I will um, just show you the stock photo here so you guys can see. And if you see behind me, this is a banner that I had ordered. I attended the Midwest Wig Sister Retreat in Bloomington a couple weeks ago, which was put on by Denise Sheets. And it was so much fun. So I had a table for Polly Young and I had wigs on display so that people could try them on. And I went ahead and ordered a banner um, so that people could see, kind of scan that. That would take them right to the Polly Young website. And of course my discount code. So I just thought it'd be fun to put it behind me in my videos. But this is the cute Erica. So she looks like she's got a little bit of a wave in her, um, but it is a long shag. And this is just your basic cap wig. I'm not gonna go into all of those features because I will be reviewing her. But let's just go ahead and try her on. All right. Oh, she feels soft. So we do have a little bit of, it looks like, box hair bangs. Um, so she got a little bit of cold crimping, they call it. And that's okay, we can spray that with water and we can use our hot air brush to sort of redirect that. But it's cute, 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 cute. You guys know my word of the day, it's cute. It's cute. Oh yeah. I love the buttered toast too. So it's a blend. It's got the blonde highlights and then it's the brunettes underneath. Now this is just your regular Canaclon fiber. So um, it is super soft. I have a tag up in here. So <laughs> that's cute, you guys. Look at that. Oh, this will be fun to review. That's a nice length. I did that other shag tucker 
Um, Tucker was a lot lighter um, as far as it was, it had so many layers that it was thinner. I actually like the feel of this one. I have a little bit more to it. So like I said, we can absolutely fix those bangs. We'll just um, use a hot airbrush. When I do the review, I will show you that. But you could do some cute little ear tucks. Yeah, she's going to be cute. I like her. Let's check out the next one. All right, so next up, I have the Jacqueline Smith. This one is Spotlight, and this is in her exclusive color, 1223 HS8. That's Wildflower Honey. And Spotlight is not a new one, but it looks like a cute little bob with bangs. And I was just thinking that would be kind of fun to have another cute bob with bangs. I have um, Jackson, and I love Jackson. So I wear Jackson a lot, but this, you can't ever have too many bobs. <laughs> ba, 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 Okay. Oh, look at that. Isn't she cute? She might look a little extra shiny just because I have two ring lights here, but that's cute. Let's go ahead and put it on. All right. Spotlight. I do find that Jacqueline Smith wigs run a little bit larger. Now, she is a basic cap. I don't know if I showed you guys that. Again, I will do a full review. So I will show you that in the review. I think it kind of came with the center part, sorry. So you can see the bangs here. Again, a little bit of the cold crimping, not a big deal. We'll use a hot air brush and we can absolutely take care of that. Um, not a ton of permatease actually. Let me just feel like, get it to how I would kind of wear it, even though I'm gonna review it just so that I can show you that it's cute. <laughs> because I don't want you to think it isn't because we know it is, oh yeah. This is lightweight. This is comfortable. Yeah, I think we can get some volume. This is cute. This is a lot cuter than I thought it would be actually. Um, also, I wanna let you guys know, all of these wigs are available. I didn't buy anything that was on clearance. I wanted to make sure that if I got hair mail that you could go out and purchase it and use my discount code. <laughs> All right, look at that. That's cute. I just love this color too. I love the dimension of it. Super cute. That is cute. Really fun. That is really fun. Really fun. Spotlight. <laughs> All right, what else do we got? Let's check it out. All right, so next up I got Hudson and I got her in Tuscany Toast. Maybe you have seen my review of Hudson. I got her in the Parisian Blonde. I'll link that below so that you can check that out if you haven't seen it. Um, just kind of a wavy, long wig. And for those of you who are familiar with Paula Young, it kind of reminds me of Misha, which was an older discontinued style. Now I have noticed that um, this one, I, I bought this one already and I've worn it in this color and I love it, but it is straighter than the one that I reviewed. The one that I reviewed, the blonde one, the Parisian blonde had more waves in it. But it, it really and truthfully, it's a long shag. And I love the Rooted Ural collection because I love the colors. I'm just gonna go ahead and try it on. Again, it's just your basic cap wig. All right. It's a little um, bang heavy, uh, but doesn't have tons of permatease, but I absolutely love the color. It does give me a little bit of the 
Bon Jovi vibes. It does give me a little bit of the big hair 80s. Um, you know, Tommy used to work on the docks. Union been on strike. He's down on his luck. It's tough. So tough. So tough. <laughs> Gina works at diner all day. Working for a man. She brings home a pay for love. Ooh, for love. She says we gotta hold on to what we got. I mean, you guys, I love this. I love all of the layers. For a long wig, this is lightweight. I absolutely love the color. And I'm so happy that I bought another one because I went ahead the other one that I have in this color, I cut the bottom layer because I was apparently, must have been hormonal. <laughs> and I was mad at myself for doing that. So, you know what? Don't be hormonal and cut your wigs. <laughs> you might regret it. All right, let's spin. I mean, isn't that pretty? So, so pretty. Just really, really gentle waves. Really loose in this one. When I um, do the review, I'm going to compare it with the Parisian Blonde. And I think that you'll be able to see the Parisian Blonde has actual more pronounced waves. So I'll show you that when I do that review. But oh, so pretty. I love, I love to just have a long one too. It's so much fun. The short ones are cute. The long ones are cute. The mid-length ones are cute. You guys, it's just the cute, 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 cute mode. I can't help it. Can't help it. <laughs> All right, so next up, we're gonna look at Brandy and I got her an SF1228, which is honey. Now, Brandy has the center um, lace part. So. Let's just check her out. She's curly. She's whisper light. Oh yeah, look at those curls. Just beautiful ringlet curls. Your center mono part. I mean, there is a little bit of play in there too if you wanted to move it a little bit off center. Um, and this one is the SF1228. Honey, look at those ringlets. It's like Nellie Olson. <laughs> All right, let's give it a try. So I just wanted to show you guys my wig grip. I wear the wig grip cap because I keep my hair um, buzz pretty short. Um, and it has that lace center. But then this is the velvet grip. So if you're a new wig wearer, that stops the wig from riding up. So let's put Brandy, baby. Actually, no, Brandy. You're a fine girl, such a fine girl. <laughs> Brandy does her best to understand. Wowzers. Wowzers. I don't remember. I have had Brandy and I have reviewed her. I didn't remember her being Rosanna, Rosanna, Dana. <laughs> okay, so on the stock photo, she does not look this full. Um, but... She's really full when you get her. Here is the that um, lace mono. I would probably pull it back a little bit. And I don't want to do too much. But she might require a little bit of thinning. Just because this she is a lot. But let's look. Oh, but the curls are pretty, you guys. Oh yeah, look at that. Brandy, you're a fine girl. Such a fine girl. Yeah, that's pretty. You know, it reminds me of um, a little bit of, is it Cameo from Jacqueline Smith? The long one, that's a, it reminds me a little bit of that. 
It's a little bit shorter than that, but very similar. Yeah. She's pretty. You know, you'll, I'll undo that part, break that part open so that you can see the lace so it will look really natural. And when I do the review, we'll see all kinds of things that we can do with Brandy. Yeah, she's pretty. Pretty, pretty, such a pretty, pretty girl. Pretty, pretty girl. <laughs> so if you have not yet subscribed to my channel, why don't you go ahead and do that and be sure to put on the notification bell so that you're alerted when I upload new videos. Now let's go ahead and get looking at the next one. All right, we're gonna go to a straight one and this is Easton in SF1228, which is also honey. So Easton is a long straight wig with bangs. It's got razored ends. Um, I have never purchased it or reviewed it, and so I thought it would be really fun, and I'm wrecking the box <laughs> to review it. And you know I love the color honey, so that bronze shade and I thought it would be fun to do the long one with the bangs and the net is getting caught on my rings. She's got rings on her fingers and bells on her toes. Okay, we just have the basic cap. Basic cap, crisscross. It looks really low density though. Very low density. I don't see any, maybe just a little tiny bit of permatease. Ooh, she's a pretty, pretty girl. Let's put her on. Easton feels like it has a pretty generous cap. Okay. Oh, those are cute bangs. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. I like that. Cute. Obviously, we know that your machine made wigs are going to come with that crisscross from the factory. We'll take that out when I do the review. I'll show you how to take that out if you're new to wigs. I'll show you how to style it um, to walk out the door because you're not going to walk out just like this, but you could. That's cute. Why have I never purchased Easton before? She is pretty. Whoa, pretty woman. Won't you pardon me? Pretty woman. I couldn't help but see. Oh, you look lovely as can be. Are you lonely just like me? Ooh, mercy. <laughs> Sorry, you guys. New hair. It just makes me break out in song. Let's look all the way around. Ooh. I like those razored ends. Um, and, and I feel like this one has more blonde um, in the way the color is distributed, even though this is um, SF1228, the same as Brandy was. But also Brandy was curly. That does make a difference. This is cute. I really like, I think, man, oh man, a lot of you, these are like perfect bangs. Perfect. Perfection. Look at that. Just perfect. Right, like sort of right at your eyebrows. For those of you that like your full bangs. God, this is pretty. Easton. Who would have known? Who would have known? I didn't know. I didn't order it. I should have ordered it a long time ago. <laughs> All right, so I am probably going to bore you guys to death because I ordered another honey. Um, so this is Kira in SF1228 Honey <laughs> because I bought these wigs for myself, right? And I wear honey a lot, obviously. I wear light, a little bit lighter colors in the summer, but um, the fall and winter months, I like to have a little bit darker. But I reviewed Kira and Glazed Toffee, which I absolutely love. I'm going to link it here. You can also expand the description box. And I love the style of Kira. Um, just with the, she just has the beautiful waves and 
perfect length for work. I've been wearing her to work every day, um, basically since I got her. And so I um, wanted to just try it in honey. So it's just a really basic wig, like basic cap with no extra front. But you can see her, how she just has these just pretty waves. And they go away from the face, which I really like. So let's go ahead and put her on. And that is why I ordered Kira, because I just think that she's perfect. <laughs> so she, this one is not as wavy as my glazed toffee. But it still is. It still has the waves and it's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's so kind of effortless. I love this length and it's nice. It's lightweight. Kira. All right, let me clean up a little bit here. <laughs> so when I review Kira, I will do a comp color comparison um, and compare it with the glazed toffee um, just so that you can see. And I'll try to get some outside looks, which it is getting hard because now um, with daylight savings is over, it is dark here by five o'clock. Um, so it's basically dark by the time I get home from work. <laughs> but I want to let you know, like on curl patterns, it is across all brands where you can have this where the curl doesn't necessarily take on all of the wigs the same. It doesn't matter color, whatever, and it doesn't matter what brand. I have seen Taz from Taz's Wig Closet talk about this a lot, where you get a style, you love it, you order another one, and the curl pattern is slightly different. It's just the way that for whatever reason the fibers on that day take. So. I still think that this is beautiful and I'm going to spin so that you can see it. <laughs> yeah, I love this length. I absolutely love it. I love it. Yeah, it's super pretty. Super pretty. If you're still watching and you want to go ahead and take a break and get a refreshment, go ahead and do that and I'll take a commercial break and let you know that this cute top that I am wearing is actually from Bloom Chic. So um, they reached out to me and they asked me if I would be willing to do a review, an Instagram reel for their Black Friday sale. So they let me pick out five items and this is one of them and I wore it to work today and I got so many compliments. So I'm gonna to try to film the review of the five items that I got this weekend and I will have a discount code for you. <laughs> All right, so we have the last wig. Let's check it out. So this is the brand new Alma and I got her in the new exclusive color chai tea. I wanted to purchase it because I did see her at the photo shoot and I thought, that it was so pretty. So a number of you have asked me if I was doing a review and Polly Young didn't send it to me, but I decided to go ahead and purchase it. <laughs> so Alma basic cap, um, but the color, oh yeah, look at her color. Isn't that pretty? Look at these, look at the wave pattern. Oh, that's gonna be cute. It's gonna be cute, cute. Let's try it. All right, Alma. Oh, Alma and chai tea. Okay, okay, hold the phone. This uh, is gonna require a little bit of water. Okay, so do you guys remember Tessa? I reviewed Tessa. And you, so many people have watched that video and so many people love her and you cannot get Tessa anymore because she was discontinued. And now this doesn't have quite the curls that Tessa had, but wow, this is really similar and this color is really similar. I think I had Tessa in the 
Parisian blonde because Tessa was a rooted euro. And um, this is gorgeous. This is like that color, the Parisian blonde. It's a it's an ash blonde. Um, you guys can see with the root, chai tea is this new color. So we do have some bangs on here. They're not um, super short, but they're nice. Like you could kind of side sweep them. I'm gonna, I'll just do a little bit more with Alma. I'll sit you, if you stay with me this long, you get a little extra. You get a little extra. Cause sometimes Beth is a little extra. <laughs> Some of you don't like that Beth is a little bit extra, but that's okay, because some of you do. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Oh, my gosh, you guys. Okay. Okay. Alma's cute. Alma, I went and saved the best for last. Cause sometimes the snow comes down in June. Sometimes the sun goes round the moon. Yeah, Alma is cute. This color is pretty. Such a pretty girl. Mm -hmm. It's cute. I'm just going to keep on playing just for a little bit. Cause sometimes I can't help myself. <laughs> I really like this you know it's like it has body and it has permatease I don't think that it's noticeable but it does it is there but the bottom is not too thick like I feel like this is a believable bottom the bottom is almost a little bit thinner than up here which is like your normal hair, right? Your normal hair, it kind of breaks off. Um, and the root may be looking dark on the camera. Um, but it's really not. It's really not that dark. I don't know if I can. It honestly, it's not. The root is not too dark. If When you see it with your like naked eye, it's not too dark. <sighs> This one is it. This is it. <laughs> Make no mistake where you are. This is it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, she's cute. Let's spin. Let's spin. Alma. Oh my gosh. I love the curl pattern. That is pretty. Look at that. Oh, it's pretty. Oh my gosh, she's pretty. I can't wear her to work tomorrow because I haven't done the review yet. And I'd like to wear her to work tomorrow because she's really cute. Um, I've been wearing Kira almost every day and glazed toffee. So this would literally be a shock if I walked into to work tomorrow with blonde hair. <laughs> yeah, the other day I went into work on um, for I have to work for elections and the one of the election judges is like, every time I see you, she's like, day or night, rain, snow, your hair always looks perfect. I just love it. She's like, <laughs> I was wearing Kira. Well, one of the male employees was in the break room when she said that. And so I didn't feel like blurting it out in front <laughs> of the guy. So I didn't, I was, I just said, Oh, thank you. You know, that's so nice of you to say, but, um, they don't notice they just do not notice when I was helping, checking people in, you know, um, registering them to vote and stuff like that. I've got compliments. I was wearing Kira. Oh my gosh, I just love your hair. I love your highlights, you know, all of that. So I just want to encourage you that, you know, you don't need a three, $400 wig. You can buy these beautiful Polly Young wigs 
with these beautiful basic caps and these beautiful colors and you've got these rooted shades and people just literally believe that you have gorgeous hair and guess what you do have gorgeous hair because it's your hair it's bought and paid for right it's your hair <laughs> all right so what did you guys think about this hair mail did you like it let me know below in the comment section what was your favorite style oh my gosh you know i'm kind of really leaning towards alma here i just think it's beautiful but honestly i loved all of them i think they're really beautiful i'm so impressed with paul young's design team with all of their beautiful colors and their styles they are just always coming out with wonderful new styles so affordable so budget friendly and on top of that remember my discount code bbh20 you can use it every single time you shop to save 20 percent that is 20 percent off of each wig that's 49.99 and over excluding clearance you can use it every time it's not a one and done and when you use that code Paula Yang knows that you watch my video so i truly truly appreciate it when you use that I also want to let you know that if you expand the description box below, I have a link below to my Facebook page, Beth's Best Hair, and also to my private Facebook group, BB Hair and Friends. I would love it if you would follow me over there, if you would join my private group. I love it if you join the private group because then when you're purchasing wigs, you can take pictures and you can share them in that group. It is a nice, safe place, a private group where you can feel comfortable in, with all of the wig sisters there and everybody is encouraging and lifting each other up. And it doesn't matter what brand you wear, you can show me pictures of anything that you're wearing. We love to see everything. I want to celebrate the beauty and the joy of wigs. If you have stuck with me the whole time, thank you all so much. I know this is probably a long video, but I truly appreciate it. And I just want to let you know that in the coming weeks, you'll see me put out reviews on all of these styles. And again, I will try to get outside looks of these new colors so that you can see them in the natural light. Thanks again, everyone, and I'll see you very soon. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm.